Hello everybody, this is Kyoshi here. Welcome back to another video. In this video, I'll be reviewing the Max Factory Yu-Gi-Oh! Seto Kaiba Papa Parade figures. Without further ado, let's get started. We'll take a look at the packaging first. This is the uh, Good Smile Company Times Max Factory series. And uh, it is one of those larger Papa Parade packaging, but it's identical. It's all window display here. Cool, nothing much going on on the packaging. You know, a lot of times I love these protective packaging. You know, they have uh, all the plastic wraps around the figures to make sure they came, you know, securely. And these are also just a better quality than, you know, those paper boxes. But a lot of times I really um, have trouble keeping these boxes. I'm not a box keeper, so usually I would throw them away if they have any dents or any defects when it come, uh, when it arrives. However, you know, still it's a, it's a pain in the ass uh, when you have so many of these boxes. You don't know what to do with them and you don't know where to just, you know, store them. Uh, most of the figures that I purchase, I would love to display them on my shelves, on, in my rooms, um, where on my work desk, uh, whatever, uh, instead of, you know, just storing them in these boxes. At the same time, you know, uh, when these figures, these boxes adds up, it just takes a lot of space and it just pain in the ass anyways enough with the bitching here any here here is the uh seto kaiba figure i uh, will do a 360 first um take a look i love the posture this is what sold me this figure for definitely i love seto seto is amazing uh character from Yu-Gi-Oh series and um this pose is just so dynamic and so cool um, I have to use the word Ikemen. Uh, I, I think I've used that a lot in my previous videos, but it's really Ikemen. What else can you talk about this? Or the other word would be Gakoi. Um, just very good looking, very cool looking, very, you know, just nice. Cool. And here we have the base, very standard Papa Pere series base. This time is uh, blue, uh, very nice. And um, here's the rest of the figure. I think I, I'm not going to go into detail, detail with the pain apps. Um, I've had enough Papa Parades already on this channel. I have reviewed a lot of these. You know that Papa Parade, you know, the, the, that brand guarantees the pain apps. Uh, it's going to be absolutely amazing. Um, I'm just going to go into details on all these, these sign work, you know, all these combo work. Just fantastic. He has a very slim build. That's how, you know, these characters look from Yu-Gi-Oh! series, um, from the creator, uh, which is the way it is. Uh, very spot on, very authentic. I love how his uh, coat, this kind of spreading out towards the end. Um, it's just so beautiful. Look at all these um, curves and all that. Wow, it's so realistic. Um, it's just so amazing. This is probably the best part of this figure. Um, and then of course, um, the paint app, everything is fantastic. I'm not, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna, I try my best to not talk a lot in terms of all oh, the paint. It's amazing. It's amazing. It's going to be amazing. And then here's the upper body of, uh, Seto. Cool. The hands, wow. The hands looks brilliant. It looks really, really cool. Um, sculpted very nicely. Um, all the details, KC right here. Um, I wish there's some pose possibilities. However, there's no possibilities, but um, I wish there's some minimum possibilities. You know, if the accessories can be removable or something like that, or interchangeable face and stuff like that, that would be great. But um, that's asking too much for the Papa Parade because we don't usually get that. And here's this arm. By the way, this the card, the Yu-Gi-Oh cards are removable. This is the only piece that came separate from this figure that you need to attach to it, and it's very easy to attach. You just attach to, you know, between these two fingers right here. They have this little gap here. It's perfect space for this. And it's very secure too. So you don't have to worry about it. It's actually very secure. Like it's, you know, I'm shipping cake really hard. It's not gonna, you know, job or anything like that. So bravo here. And then face, it's authentic. It's spot on. Um, I think this is a very nice posture. I mean, not posture, uh, very nice face expression cool yeah the rest of the body um it's just my the best part that i like the most is definitely the the way this cave is spread it the, the way it's curved so natural so cool looking 
really in. Um, the figure has some weights to it. It's not heavy, heavy, but it has some weights to it. And I do feel the plastic is very high class or high end, made with some very high end plastic materials. They are doable. Of course, uh, you don't want to chip it. You know, it will break. But um, it, it, it does made out of some very doable plastic. You can just feel it. Um, yeah, cool. Uh, motor it, play, it's all right. But since these are just statue figures, um, I don't know how you're going to play it. Usually these are made for this play. But uh, motor it, playing, um, it's fine. But yeah, this is a 10 out of 10 for me. Uh, definitely uh, a, a one of a kind purchase. I love it. I love the posture. I love everything about this figure. No disappointments here. So here is my review of the Max Factory Yu-Gi-Oh! Seto Kaiba Papa Parade figure. And thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!